Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned Club Kings of Europe? It's PSG. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. the night everyone in the football world has been longing for millions will be watching around the world it is of course the biggest final in club football the uefa champions league final welcome to the commentary box derek ray here joined by stuart robson it's mbappe Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep it at play and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Chouameni. Here's Valverde. Sloppy in possession from Real. Rodrigo. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Well, PSG unable to retain possession. Sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top class player. So, on with the match. 2 1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Mbappe! And the deflection there before it went over the byline. It's going to be a corner. Not the most confident clearance. Nicely blocked. Wait on the pass. Is it going to be? Oh, strong hand on the ball. That's going to dispossess your opponent. Considerable space afforded Real Madrid. Opportunity here. And the keeper held to deal with it. And there's the delivery. We're trying his luck with the header, but too much elevation. Toro Muani. Here is Marco Asensio. Well, approaching the half-time whistle and PSG narrowly behind. Stuart, your assessment to this point? Well, it's certainly been an open game with chances for both teams. But they must start winning some of those individual battles, particularly in the wide areas, if they're going to get anything out of this. Really good, strong tackle. And it'll be a throw-in. was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. And the referee's whistle. That will be... Second half underway with Real looking to build upon a positive first half showing.
Vinicius Jr. Oh, nothing productive, really. Dembele. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? It's gone in! A goal for PSG beyond the goalkeeper to square things up. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. And level again here. This has been quite the run against the run. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, back on the way, and a glut of goals here. 3-2. Oh, could be! Oh, he's missed it! Well, he'd be very disappointed with that. He should be scoring from there. with Vinicius Junior Rodrigo and return to Rodrigo Bellingham and not cleared away properly he comes it back and a goal I'll tell you what they're going to be very hard to catch now name on the trophy maybe well let's have another look at this because he does really well to pick the right pass here. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. And good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. 20 minutes to go. Chance to cross. Pivotal moment defensively. And just the tackle that was needed. Bellingham. And now Rodriguez. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Vinicius! Oh, he couldn't out with the keeper. Now the cutback. And he's tempted out. And the referee says penalty. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Toro Muani. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. And the perfect position to read it. And teammates around him. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Mbappe tries his luck and fired against the crossbar. Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. It's looking promising. Must score! Penalty! in the opinion of the referee and this is seriously getting away from them well then a sending off to boot but it goes from bad to worse they just haven't played well today <laughs> to finish it as a contest and the spot kick is converted as calmly as you like. Well, 
Here's the replay. And it takes a lot of courage to hit a penalty like that. The goalkeeper just moves out of the way and it goes down the middle. It's an excellent execution, but always risky. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners... Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to...